Hey guys, what is going on? My name is NoJ456, and today I'm going to be talking about some possible modifications that you will be able to put on cars whenever heist come out. As you guys know, if you missed my video a little bit ago, I'll just recap it real quick. Basically, what happened is that there was coding found in Los Santos Customs that checked if you have the heist DLC. So obviously, heist DLC is coming. It's in the coding. Uh, there are already references of the heist DLC, and they're basically checking if you have the heist DLC to put on special modifications to cars in Los Santos Customs. So today, I'm going to be going through some of my wants and some my kind of predictions for what might be coming uh, as part of this heist DLC as different car modifications that you can put on your cars. This is going to be a gigantic DLC, one that we waited for for a long, long time. So if they don't deliver a bunch of things, then it's going to be kind of a disappointment. And I really do think Rockstar is planning and gearing up for a huge, huge heist DLC. So anyway, let's go ahead and jump into it here with the first prediction and kind of want that I have for this DLC. And that is a bull ram that goes on front of your car. Now this is yeah, kind of the kind of official name for this is like a cow pusher that have these on trains but obviously this one's a little bit more menacing this one will be used to kind of clear ways maybe you put this on a gigantic truck anything with a lot of horsepower to kind of knock the cars out of the way if you're escaping from the police if they have the blockade up or anything like that just have this truck or whatever whatever car has this on it just ram through the middle of them and then have the rest of the cars follow in behind them so the next thing up are these different little tire spikes now obviously this cannot go on really really tiny cars simply because it'll just spin the car out however if you have like a muscle car a uh, supercar anything like that and you throw these onto the side of it if any police cars are up next to you trying to spin you out or anything you can just ram into them and use this to pop their tires and obviously if you have pop tires it's much much harder to drive and the police would spin out almost immediately and especially if you're if you're ramming into them and popping their tires they're not gonna be able to follow you for very long so i think this would be a very very cool modification and uh, obviously it wouldn't be too too hard to code just kind of say like if you have a collision with the tire with these tire spikes then you could uh, just pop the tire so i don't think it's too far off the truth or maybe something that they could possibly do obviously if they can code anything they want to but they're gonna go for the easier stuff because it is rockstar and they're kind of focusing on next gen but anyway the next thing up is kind of recommissioning the jb 107 I, I forget what the numbers are but basically yeah having a recommissioned version of this the the, the guns on the side obviously were in, used in the campaign version a whole bunch i think we used two different missions for this car and just have this recommissioned have it actually available to use and online and be able to use the machine guns on this now this would be great for like pulling up to a bank just shooting into the inside or maybe like uh robbing the fib again anything like that no matter what the heist could be you could use this and uh, I think it'd just be awesome to have car a car with guns on it in, uh, in, in any fashion or anything like that. So the next one up would be great for night night heist, anything like that, anything during the night. It would be just these giant floodlights that go on top of a truck, go on top of a car, whatever you can put it on, just basically throw on some floodlights and you can turn these on and off, maybe the same way that you turn the uh, grappling hook on and off in the uh, cargo bob, something like that. They're just right on the D-pad, left on the D-pad, up on the D-pad, whatever it would be, and you could basically turn on these giant floodlights. Now this could be used to blind cars, uh, that are driving at you, lay it way to illuminate roads, something like that. I think it'd just be a really, really neat addition and uh, something that would definitely work. And my last one up, I'm actually going to show a little bit of a video clip, a very, very short amount because I'm allowed to use up to five seconds of a vid video clip, but this from Fast and Furious. <laughs> So some kind of tow cable on the back of the car, maybe some kind of like wiring system where you can basically hook it up to cars, hook it up to just basically bank vaults, whatever it could be, just would be so, so much fun. There's so many opportunities for stunting with this, doing a crazy tricks with this. And obviously it's just a lot of fun to drive around a huge safe behind your car and kind of having it attached to two of them and slingshotting it, stuff like that. So uh, anyway, all this put together, what this would look like if you put it all together on one car would be kind of this concept design right here. It has the tire spikes, it has the battering ram, it has the floodlights, and and uh, it, it kind of has that like cage around it. So obviously this cage would be a really, really simple addition as well. And overall, I think this would be the perfect heist vehicle. It's a little bit ridiculous, but then again, GTA is a little bit ridiculous in general with all of the DLC that they put in there. There's always kind of ridiculous clothing, ridiculous weapons uh, like the fireworks launcher and stuff like that. And I don't think this would be too far off what like my perfect idea of a DLC. Uh, anyway, and the uh, heist modifications on the car part of it, I think this would be the perfect DLC. So uh, anyway, if you have any other additions let, them, let me know in the comment section down below let me know how they would work how that like if it would be easier or hard to add into the game and why or why not but uh anyway that's about it for this video if you guys did enjoy go ahead and leave a like that'd be very very much appreciated and subscribe for more i'm gonna be updating you guys on all the official information as soon as it comes out but anyway my name is noj456 and i'll see you guys in the next video